Hey Josh, did you score a DVD? Sure did, sis. The bank upped my credit card limit to $5,000. I've maxed it out already. He got this camera phone too. You can surf the web and play wicked games. Hey Josh, your SMS horoscope came through. Wish I had a phone like that. Hey, it's Kaz's birthday soon. I want to get her a pair of jeans like yours, Lena, if I can afford it. Pretty expensive present. These jeans cost 120 bucks. Kaz always gives me expensive things. Woohoo! My horoscope says I'm in for a big surprise. You kids seem to have a lot of money to throw around. Josh, your apprenticeship doesn't start for another month. How are you paying your bills? And what about the interest on that credit card? Chill, Mum. I'm doing heaps of shifts at the Pizza Palace. Anyway, you buy stuff on credit all the time. I'm trying to keep this house running, son. We're behind in rent, the car rego is due. I hate putting things on credit, but I'm stuck. Talk to the hand, Mum. Come on, Lena, I'll drive you home. Maybe your mum's got a point, Josh. Paying off this car plus insurance must cost loads and you're using your mobile heaps. Relax, babe. I'm a bit behind, but I'll catch up. Anyway, the car came with insurance, so I'm sweet. Mm, you sure? Anyway, thanks for the ride. Yo, Mario! What's up? Sorry about this, mate, but we're cutting your pizza shifts at the palace. But I've worked there for three years. Can't afford you now, mate. You're 18 and you're a bit too expensive. So much for my big surprise. Oh, man. I better email Lena a video message and tell her. Bad news, Lena. I've lost my job and... What the hell? Mom, I need a mobile like Josh's. It's really cool. But my part-time job at the bakery isn't enough to pay off a contract. Can you help me? Sorry, love. Can't you get a prepaid? Josh's phone may look cool, but there is nothing cool about having a huge bill every month. With a prepaid, you buy a phone card from the newsagent and you can stay in control of the costs. Hmm. Mum's got a point. I could save money for other stuff. Like that holiday for Mum. Don't freak out, Mum. But I was in a crash. My car's a write-off. Oh, thank goodness you're not hurt. At least you've got comprehensive insurance. Not anymore. I couldn't keep up with the payments. I thought I was okay with third-party personal insurance. But the cops reckon it won't cover me for the damage to my car or the car I hit. It gets worse. Because I bought the car with finance from the car yard, I'm paying a much higher interest rate. Now I have a debt, but no car. You need to speak to a financial counsellor, love. I wish I could stay at your place, Kaz. Things are pretty heavy around here. Poor Sammy, but cheer up. Only two more sleeps till my birthday. Can't wait to see what you're getting me. If I save $30 a week for six months, I'll have enough for a holiday for mum. Let's see, there are 26 weeks in six months, so if I save $30 each week, that works out at... $780, a holiday, yay. And if I save another $30 for only five weeks, I can also buy a prepaid mobile and credit. I don't know if I could afford those jeans for Kaz though. Kaz, my present to you is a night out at the movies with me. I'll cook dinner too. I'd love that. I'm glad you didn't say you got me clothes. I'm so over all the brands. I hate being a walking ad. Like, doesn't anyone dress like an individual anymore? A walking ad? That's so true. The phone company says if you don't pay your bill, they're going to take you to court. And the interest on the credit card is through the roof, plus the car. It's okay, Mum. I spoke to a financial counsellor. I've called the phone company and the car dealer, and they've given me extra time to pay. I've cancelled my credit card too. I'm going to pay them off in small amounts. Oh, you're going to be in debt for years. Yeah, Mum. But there's no quick and easy way out. I might already have a bad credit rating for being behind on my payments, which could stop me from buying another car or even an apartment when I'm older. From now on, let's promise each other to try and save up for the things we need. Yeah, we don't need the stress. Are you guys going out tonight? Nah, no money, sis. Most of my pay from my new job goes towards my debts, but they're getting smaller. But at least you're in a better mood these days, now you've sorted out how you're going to pay your debts off. Yeah, and it's good to be back in control. And in a few months I can start saving for a new car too. With full insurance, of course. Have you told Mum about her surprise yet? Nope, she's just about to find out. What's this brochure, kids? 
It's your holiday mum. I saved up and bought us two tickets up the coast. I can't believe it. Thanks, Sammy. And a few months ago, I arranged to have some of my pay transferred to a separate account. Now I've got some savings set aside so Josh can come too. Plus, we've got some spending money. Unreal! Now this is living to the max. True. Yeah, and without the monthly bill. 